Hey guys, my name is Jim Rose. I'm here with you for Sound Pro Live. Recently, Bill Evans asked me if I wanted to come on board with him to do some writing, some uh, video, some blogging, and stuff for his e-zine. And I said, sure, why not? It seemed like a fun thing to do. So here I am. Uh, for those of you that don't know me, I am a audio engineer, tour manager, production manager in the touring industry. I've been at it for a while, but along with that, I'm a gadget freak and I love to fiddle. So this seemed like the perfect opportunity for me to share some of the things that I've done, some of the things I'm doing, uh, some design ideas, just some fun stuff that, you know, some of you might already know this, some of you might learn, some of you might just find it interesting to pay attention to me being an idiot. Uh, so here we go. Uh, this seemed like the perfect time for me to jump into it. Midas Digital just dumped a new console called the Pro 2 in September. Uh, that console being launched put Midas Digital into a price point that most people can afford. You can now get 96K Midas Digital for between twenty and $30,000. In August, they also dropped the price of their consoles by about 30% by taking over in-house distribution and losing the middleman. All of that is great. Uh, one of the big things in the industry that we're seeing now is people who are touring with digital want to multi-track their shows and want to have a record solution. The Midas solutions for that are still expensive or limited. You can get a full 96K recording using their 9696 recorder. Uh, that's a boatload of cash. You can also use their network bridge, the DN9650, with third-party cards. Unfortunately, the cards that are available once you hit 32 channels, you need to format convert to 48K. It's great if you're below 32 channels, but I wanted to have a solution that would do everything. So I started researching a little further, and I came up with a company called Link Studios. Uh, I called them up, talked to them, and I found out that they had partnered up with Midas back a few years ago, and they took one of their AES cards for a PCI Express slot in a Mac Pro, and, and they, uh, they added an AES 50 slot so that you can uh, go with an AES 50 through these cards, and you can pick up 24 channels of 96K through each card. Mac Pro Tower has three slots available in it. So I said, hey, why not give this a shot? Uh, and I bought three cards off of Lynx, and here I have a record solution that uh, should be able to do 72 channels of Midas 96K record through this little rig on the road. Uh, if you're running a Pro 6, Pro 9, a full-size Pro or XL8 console, you can hook this computer into your KVM switch, run it through the console. If you're one of the people that's purchasing a new Pro 2, you can put a small rig to like this together for five or six grand and you can be into full multi-tracking with a rig that'll give you a great 96k recording across everything that you have. I'm going to stop there but uh, we're going to be doing a bunch of video on the build of this rig, uh, testing of it and uh, showing how it works coming up in the next month. Talk to you guys later.